a correspondent who spoke to Waiko and Shabir, what are the points Waiko made before he launched that march? Well, Waiko was very clear that uh, Rajapakse's visit to India is not acceptable to them because uh, it will hurt the sentiments of the Tamils living in this country and he has uh, committed genocide. That is what his claims are uh, and this is something Waiko has been talking about uh, for the past uh, several years but at the same point of time let's not forget uh, that Sri Lankan Tamil's issue has been an emotive issue in the state of Tamil Nadu. At the same time political parties have been using this issue to whip up emotions. Uh, uh, just a few days ago we saw Karnanidhi holding a TESO conference in which uh, uh, he wanted to pressurize the Indian government to take up this issue, Sri Lankan issue and to uh, you know get justice for uh, the, 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 the Tamils who were uh, killed in that uh, uh, Sri Lankan war and also later on uh, immediately after the TESO conference which Karnanidhi conducted, Jalalata took up this issue in which she vigorously opposed uh, training of uh, defense personnel and now Waiko has picked up this issue and he is leading the battle with taking on uh, uh, Rajapakse when he is uh, coming to uh, Madhya Pradesh. So all these parties want to right, capitalize Shabir. on the Sri Lankan Tamil issue but at the ground level we right. will have to wait and see right, what the public right,